what is up youtube bunny films here with a brand new video and we are back in farming and friends today with some new content i hope you are all having a fantastic day it is the new year we're gonna hit 100,000 subscribers this year so subscribe if you enjoyed today's video but um we are in farming and friends this is a free game to play link will be in the description i highly recommend checking out because you basically get to run your own farm and i think that is pretty awesome but in today's video so last video if you remember um we uh, basically sold this entire field of potatoes and we made about 10 million uh coins total and like revenue i think yeah revenue um but uh, we did have to make some chocolate milk and in today's video we're going to go ahead and sell all that chocolate milk and see how much we get and i'll show you guys like the basic process i failed that jump but i'll show you the basic process on how to make chocolate milk because it is very good to sell i don't know if it's like worth selling but you get like twenty thousand per jug of chocolate milk and i think that's pretty awesome so for starters um to make milk you obviously need cows so let's go ahead we need to herd all of the cows and to herd them all you do is just click on them uh where's the other ones i have five total and i think this barn holds like 12 or 14 but we're gonna go ahead press move animals and then you can move them to anywhere you'd like we're gonna move them to the barn there we go and they're gonna walk in slot uh inside hopefully sometimes they have issues with the ai or not the ai but like the pathfinding or whatever also i don't know why there's milk jugs everywhere oh yeah and like a little psa i do want to put out there like a public service announcement is that my username on roblox is bunny films one that is it. If anyone else is claiming to be me, it's not true. Don't listen to anyone. I mean, if I don't have my iconic avatar with my top hat and my red hair and my uh, bunny film shirt, that ain't me, okay? That ain't me. I mean, sometimes I'll have, like, the crazy hairdo. I don't... I, I, I sometimes have that crazy avatar going on. But if someone's claiming to be me and their username's not Bunny Films one then they're not me. Because I, I recently had a comment... Or several comments from someone who actually got scammed by someone claiming to be me. And I, I don't even trade. So this is in Lumber Tycoon 2, by the way. Someone thought someone got scammed by someone claiming to be me. Uh, but I don't even trade in Lumber Tycoon 2. Um, so that's one way you can tell myself apart from the imposters. Uh, but also the username is just a big indicator. Someone claiming to be me is not me. Because I don't go out there saying I'm Bunny Films. I'm Bunny Films. I mean, you know I'm Bunny Films because... The avatar and the username but that's that if you do choose to play this game though i do have some awesome tips though you can use code bunny films that's right code bunny films capital b and capital f uh and you can get yourself some extra cash in the game i think it's really helpful so put that code in all you have to do is go up to the social tab up here and press enter code and type in that code and that will give you like 10 percent of how much money you have so if you have um like one thousand dollars it'll give you a hundred dollars basically it's really really helpful so definitely recommend getting it but we're gonna go ahead we're gonna get our milk truck or this is the uh, medium liquid truck and we're gonna load all of these regular milks up into there and then this is part of the process for making chocolate milk so let's go ahead and get all of them loaded up and for chocolate milk you actually need cocoa as well which i actually don't have on my farm anymore i used to actually have um I'd say maybe six fields of cocoa, but I did get rid of most, of all of them actually, just for the sake of potatoes, because potatoes are far, far, far more profitable. So we don't have cocoa, sadly, um, anymore, but we do have plenty in storage. We have uh, like 258 there. So nothing really to worry about, but we do need milk. And milk is pretty difficult to come by just because it takes like three minutes for a cow to be like milkable, basically. And then they only produce one to three uh, jugs of milk. So the most we can get from five cows is 15 jugs, which will only produce one jug of chocolate milk because chocolate milk actually requires 10 cocoa and 10 milk. So cocoa part, super duper easy. Milk part very difficult to get all that of milk so maybe in the future the developers will add like bigger barns like automated barns or like can i not get in here oh that's a bummer it's like the hitbox for the barn is i feel as if they made this into a mesh or something and the hitbox is like really bad or whatever i don't know like i can't hop into the cow pens maybe it's designed like that who knows we're gonna get all of our milk jugs we'll see if we can even get that one because it's gonna be inside the cow pen which we can't actually get into for some reason. And then we'll actually see how much milk we have. We might be able to make like one more, or maybe even two more jugs of milk, but that'd be if we got like 14 out of 15, which I don't think we did. But we might have. I don't know, but let's see. 
I cannot even reach this jug of milk because it is stuck. That is a big... Oh, there we go. Just had to put my camera inside. Uh, hello. There we go. Say hi to everyone in the chat. Uh, but let's go ahead. We're going to load this up here. Voila. Hop inside of here, and then it goes automatically into here. And luckily, we did get exactly 14 jugs of milk, which is actually pretty great. So now we are able to make two more chocolate milk jugs because we have 20 milk and 258 cocoa. So let's hop inside of the factory. And by the way, you have to build a chocolate milk factory if you do want to actually make chocolate milk. So go under the build tab, go under create, and then you should see the chocolate milk factory for 50,000 coins. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go inside and close the door behind me. And let's begin the fun process. So there's like, you have to press a bunch of levers and stuff or pull a bunch of levers. And I think that is fun. Like instead of just pressing one button, you get to like watch the process. And I also like the little animations. So we'll press F and then they'd have like the little stamper. And then we have this one here, which is like a grinder. There we go. Look at all the sparkles. And then the next one is a blender of sorts. And you only have to do this once in all of the milk in, or you, you will use all of the resources in your factory that can actually be contributed. So if we actually go outside, we can see it. I don't know if it already did. I think it already did. Yeah, but the chocolate milk fell from the little output here. And now we need to go ahead and load it up into our uh, milk truck. So let's go ahead and we're going to drive this over here like this and i did originally plan on making it so like i or planning on a i did plan on a video where i'd sell all of the chocolate milk and make like a million dollars but like i already made the chocolate milk so i think it's too late okay let's actually go ahead and there is a cool way you can actually fill it up let's just drive this here like that and then if you just press i think v you um basically stand near chocolate milk it automatically goes into the um milk truck which i think is really really convenient it's like a nice little trick i didn't even know existed until like a few days ago well let's continue doing that just pressing v get all the chocolate milk loaded up or i can just press f and then f and then v there we go and then one more and then let's see how much chocolate milk we actually have okay we have 24 chocolate milk which is going to give us some pretty decent money so let's see chocolate milk we have to actually go ahead and head down here to the animal store or like the produce store, whatever you want to call it. But this is where you like buy cows, you buy chickens and you also buy, um, what else? Oh, you can like sell eggs and milk basically. And you also can buy animal feed. Uh, that's a cool farm there. Lots of pebbles, like lots of pebble roads. But well, let's head over here and I do need to get a thumbnail. I'll do that later, I guess. Okay. Mm and over here is where you sell. And now if we go ahead and pull into this area over here where it has the milk jug listed, we can actually sell all of all 24 of our chocolate milk for half a million coins. And I think that's pretty awesome considering we only have 24 and we can fit like what, 50 in here, I think. I don't, it, it usually tells you, but for whatever reason, it's not telling me. So it would originally sell for 480,000, but we're actually in, um, Let's see, we're in the Dun Games group on Roblox. That gets us an extra 24,000 coins, which is super helpful. So let's go ahead and sell. We now have an extra five and a half or um, half a million dollars in, or half a million coins. I, 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 I try to like be respectful to the currency in the game because it's coins and like dollars is American. But we're going to head back to our farm now and we'll see what else there is left to do. Um, and there might be a few like basic tasks, like we might be able to milk the cows again uh maybe even make another chocolate milk but really awesome that we were able to solve that chocolate milk it took about two months to get all of that but i do want to give a shout out to wait let's see what's the price Ooh, potato that's eh, decent uh but i do want to give a shout out to the player who actually gave me a lot of chocolate milk i don't remember the username but i do remember um him actually giving me several like jugs of milk and loading it into my uh, chocolate milk factory which is super super helpful so thank you so much for actually doing that it was, it was really kind of you and you know who you are uh but we're gonna go ahead and can we get out of our vehicle no we cannot of course we cannot uh come on there we go we're out so this factory pretty nice i'm gonna close the door really quickly there we go and zero out of 600 and the only way you can actually load into here is actually having a trailer um placed on top of the great well not a trailer but like any like liquid holding trailer um or liquid holding vehicle or trailer um on that grate so uh keep that in mind you can't just drop the milk on top i mean you might be able to but i don't think that's how it works 
So now we're going to go ahead and we're just going to clean up our, uh, our our farm a little. We're going to put all these into storage uh, just because uh, they're sort of on top of the field and it'll stop us from actually farming the entirety of it. So let's actually go here, um, respawn things, semi-trailer respawn. Uh, what else? That and that. There we go. And I think they changed it. So when you spawn trailers in here, um, they actually face or the trailer hitch. Um, actually faces tour or the tow hitch. I don't know what it's called, but it actually faces towards the exit, which makes my life so much easier. I complained about it um, in like their Discord server. Well, not complain, complain, but like it was like a I filed a complaint basically. Because how am I supposed to get a tr like, for example, this piece of equipment over here? Uh, let me show it to you guys really quickly. Um, uh, how am I supposed to get? Oh, I do need to put those inside of there. Um, but if we look here, how the heck? Am I supposed to get this out if it's facing the opposite way? I literally have to run over the equipment and then try backing out. But then most of the times I get, I get flung and I get stuck in the ceiling. That, that happens so many times. But we're actually going to go ahead. We need to respawn that as well. I think maybe I have to detach it. Uh, so let's go ahead and press X. There we go. And now I'll press, uh, let's see, reorganize garage. I'll respawn things. There we go. Respawn. Res oh, yeah, I have four semi-trailers. I forgot about that. Okay, let's respawn all that, and then what else? Um, I'll respawn that as well, okay. Theater, I mean, I'll, I'll just respawn everything, why not? Uh, just get it out of the way, I suppose. Okay, that doesn't fit, sadly. I think pretty much everything else has been respawned that we can. So let's actually go ahead and... I think someone's giving me seeds, so thank you. Uh, but over here, let's see, where's my cedar? So we have our cedar there, our plow, and then our cultivator. Also, I know you guys are, like, eager to see who the winner is for the building competition. Um, oh my goodness. I'm still setting up the form. Someone's calling me. Uh, but someone's, or, I'm setting up the form right now for voting, because there's, like, 85 submissions, and it's actually pretty difficult to do, like, a randomizer. So I'm still figuring that out, but you can expect it any day now in my Discord server. But speaking of my Discord server, I do owe a shout-out to all of my boosters. Um, if you do enjoy the server, this is the link right here. Here. But a big shout out to Syrup, Nade, Devil, Dexter Cly, Matthew1164, One Mangry Gamer, Lystrosaur, The ISS, Nago Films, Big Blocks Dad, Billy Bob, Six Picks, Biddy Boy, CJan, Cola, Dexter Cly, DQ3W5, El Taco, Finbar Fusion, Liming Lumber, Nay, Officer Frank, Reed, Ricardo, Ricardo, Sergio, uh, Gilberto, The Canadian Badger, Wall203, WSL Plays, Lowell's Guy Owner, Nika, Ali, Liam's, uh, Mr. OK, and Al Aliwa. So, and Brady Gamer 110. I, I I have to update the list, but we got so many boosters. I think we got like at least seven boosters within the last few days. So I will update that. But boosters get a free shout out along with channel members. Uh, but that is it for today's video, everyone. That was just a bit uh, a bit of a nice short video of us selling chocolate milk. But in the next one, uh, we'll figure out something uh, fun to do. If you have any suggestions, comment them below. I always read all my comments. But have a fantastic day, everyone. Thank you for watching and goodbye.